Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks. And somebody sent me this puzzle that was part of a file and they're having trouble with it because uh, there's a lot of double lines. If we look at that one particular and go to object and break the curve apart, uh, there's two sets of line. One way we could fix it without using a macro that I have that will uh, take away uh, double lines, but if we smart filled it, you can see what happens sometimes some of them are leaking. So that won't really work. So what we need to do first of all is select it all and turn it into a hairline. I'm gonna hit F12 on the keyboard and turn them into a hairline. <clears throat> Just because it needs to be a hairline anyway, I think they wanna score the inside and cut the outside. But now I'm gonna select it all and I'm gonna try to weld it. Um, now this is gonna take a little bit of time but it's faster than uh, moving or doing it by hand, I think. So I set my nudge factor on 25 or nine inches. I'm gonna fill that in and it's taken a little bit of time to fill them in, but what's gonna happen, you can, uh, we've got some separation there in that when we, uh, I'm gonna do just one line and your computer might do it faster than this. Mine got a pretty old laptop, but just wait for it to fill in. And then when you've got them over here, you can left click, right click. And now there's gonna be double lines because the pieces are putting uh, joined, uh, but there's really no way around that uh, per se. I mean, it can be done, but, and it's not that hard. It just takes some time and you can see the double lines. Uh, so what we're gonna do, we're gonna change our nudge factor like to uh, two inches, and we're gonna nudge this guy out of the way. Now this would take a lot of time, and it might even be beneficial to do this one. And see, we got those, and then go up to uh, select it with the uh, shape tool, and break everything apart by right clicking. And then the part that we want to delete, this isn't, this is only to get rid of this problem. So if we do that, and then we move that back, there's no double lines. So if you did every other one and do them one line at a time, so just move it over, and what that's gonna do, it's gonna keep it from just scoring at one time. Now there's some somebody that knows what they're talking about is probably laughing. Uh, there's a, probably a better way, but I'm just breaking them apart and then taking the, uh, now this is gonna get a little bit more difficult when we get in those other pieces, but just remember, and then uh, because there's an odd amount, we need to do this piece. Uh, just take the shape tool, right click, and break it apart and just delete the part you know you don't need and then nudge it back. So now it's not gonna score, but one time on that line, as you can see. So that's gonna take some time without a doubt. Uh, it almost be easier maybe don't use that puzzle and use a, uh, some sort of puzzle generator, but I think they all kind of do that. So I'm gonna do, um, well, I really need to do a couple of rows to, to figure out. I'm gonna pause the video and, well not pause it, I'm gonna stop the video and make a part two on this. I'll go through here and fix everything. Hope that helped, thank you for watching.